A lot of people are wondering what's going on with Joe Teichman. I don't know. I don't have the answer to that. Welcome to Tennis in a Minute. I'm your host, Good Energy. Now, I recently saw she now has Alina Svitolina's old coach. And look, I think the main thing with Joe Teichman, I think she's got to work on her serve, right? I think I think she's always athletic, uh, but she does have to work on her serve. Now, she's she's dropped in the rankings. She's ranked 75th now. She has not made it past the second round in any tournament this year except for the, uh, I want to say, the Indian Wells and maybe the Adelaide. So she's struggling big time. That is not the performance of a top-tier player. Now, I've always said, I think Jill Teichman, I think she's a top-40 player. And uh, I I don't want to say top-30, definitely not top-20. I think top-30 is pushing it. I I think she's a top-40 player. Because I think she needs to work on her serve. But Jill Teichman overall, I do think she's fit and athletic. Uh, She's a crafty lefty. She can construct points. But she's struggling. She's only 12-12 and this year. I mean, coming off of a 25-win season. She's taking on Emma Navarro, who's ranked 82nd, but is blossoming big time. Emma Navarro's coming off of a a 30-win season. She's literally dominating right now. 25 27 wins 27 and 9 this year she's playing a lot of tennis ladies and gentlemen she's won eight of her last 10 matches and this has got to be a confidence booster for jill teichman winning the first set 6-4 because emma navarro is she's skilled she's a very skilled player upcoming american jill teichman's the older player here but i mean i i i she, she's going through something right now and she recently did an interview where she um she mentioned that um a lot of people perceive her as you know you know cocky arrogant and just kind of self-centered and i mean i can i can see how people can can think that of her because she she kind of walks with this little swag she kind of bounces around like it's you just have to see her actions and i think a lot of people judge her more on her actions because she doesn't really talk much uh she's somewhat quiet you know it, it, at least it appears to be but the reality here is uh, listening to that interview I do think that um, I got to know her a little bit better from her perspective and she said look on the outside you may think that way but once you get to know me I'm really a sweet nice person and look I'm pretty sure that's the case but on the court we got to figure out what's going on Joe Teichman's not doing well She's not getting out of the second round. She is being bounced out of the first round in these tournaments. And, I mean, she just made the coaching change. So maybe there's a possibility that they're working on new things that she just has to put together. That's the only thing I can think of. But right now, this is a confidence booster. She takes the first set against Emma Navarro, and she's up a break already in the second.